everybody. Thanks for tuning in today. My name is Miss Christina and today I'm going to teach you how you can make a really cool art project that will look something like this using a tool that you may be able to find in your kitchen. Do you know what this is? Watch. Woo! This is a salad spinner. And if you want to learn how you can use this to make this, just keep watching. All right, for this project, you are going to need a salad spinner. You'll also need some paint in the colors of your choosing. I'm using washable tempera paint. And you'll also need either a paper plate or some cardstock or maybe a piece of construction paper. I definitely wouldn't recommend copy paper because it's too lightweight and it would just flop around and fold over on itself. So you'll definitely want something a little sturdier. The small paper plate just so happens to fit perfectly in my salad spinner, but you could also trace the bottom of the basket onto a piece of paper, cut that out and toss that into the basket. And now you're going to add your paint. So something about like that will probably be good. And I don't think I would use more than probably about three colors because you don't want it to get too muddied, but you can try it out and see. All right. Once you've added your paint, you can go ahead and put the top of the spinner on and go ahead and start spinning. All right, now let's take the top off and see how it looks. Ooh, very nice. This is also a really great color mixing lesson because you can see how the red and the yellow mix together to make orange and the blue and the yellow mix together to make green and the red and the blue mix together to make purple. So this is tons of fun and no two will be exactly alike. You see these two that I made? I use the same colors, but they don't look the same, do they? They've got a totally different pattern. So give this a try at home, have lots of fun with it, and we'll see you next time.